For Parisians, the wait for a test is still testing their patience, despite new centres opening after waits of up to 10 days for results. Neither the masks nor the hastily erected marquees have stopped France from recently recording more deaths in a day from Covid than any time since the country emerged from lockdown. Unfortunately, this summer was the summer when Europe forgot coronavirus, despite what was going on in the USA, what was going on in, in South America and now India. It seemed to be this is somebody else's problem, was the attitude. In France, there are no restrictions on households mixing, though authorities can prevent gatherings of more than 10 in public places. And masks worn in workplaces and shops are now required outside too in some areas. In Spain, household gatherings of up to 10 are permitted, although in areas like Madrid, that's been reduced to six. And in the hardest hit places, travels restricted to schooling, essential work or medical treatment. Over the weekend, those changes brought protesters out onto the streets of the Spanish capital. But the lockdown is seen very differently by Carol Sands. This is home video of her mother, who died during the first wave of the virus. Fue una pena porque no pudimos verles, no pudimos hablar con ellos. No, perdón. Es lo más duro, ¿no? De, de todo esto, el el que no te despides de ellos, porque además y me salto las normas, me quito la mascarilla, te doy un beso, te abrazo, te, que estoy poniendo, te estoy poniendo en peligro, o sea, porque el peligro existe. The rise in cases is partially a consequence of more testing, but hospitals are starting to fill. Right now at my hospital, which is not one of the busiest hospitals, uh, one third of our beds are occupied by COVID-19 patients. And 50% of our uh, ICU beds are also um, occupied by COVID-19 patients. Uh, but we expect a, a rise, a more rap rapid rise over the next uh, couple of weeks. In France, the police are once again reinforcing the rules. But if there was ever a chance of staying ahead of the virus here, it's long since departed. Rachel Younger, News at 10.